first step, you're going to want to head over to the arcade and purchase yourself an eraser. So head over to the shop, find the eraser, and purchase one if you don't have one. Basically, you can press B to pull up your book, you can go to arcade, go to prizes, and then you can go to your eraser and we're going to use it as a position guide on where to put your cursor for the shot. Step 2. Make sure you are on 1080p, 90 FOV, and your game is set to 60 FPS if you are playing single player. If you're not, it's automatically going to be capped at 60 FPS. One of the most important things about making a consistent shot is never to move your camera until you take your last shot. So zoom all the way in, do not move your camera, open up your book, go to the eraser. What you are going to want to do is line up your cursor with the right side of the letter U in butt. And then you want to align it to the top of the letter T. So right side of the U, top of the T. Right in this spot here. And then you're going to take your first shot. Again, don't move your camera. You don't want to move your mouse until the ball stops moving. You're going to take your cursor. You're going to go up to this little black line on the stone here. You're going to align your cursor with that black line. And then go over to the wood but you want to stop on the edge of the stone. So aligned with the black line, but on the stone, not quite on the door, right where my cursor is. This is pixel perfect, so it needs to be exactly here. And then for the timing of the shot, you want the red things to be moving to the left, right as I do here. And then you should get it in two shots. Now, due to the programming of the game, the physics are tied to frame rate, so if you are not host, sometimes you won't know if the game is running consistently at 60 FPS. Things might pan out a little differently in a multiplayer match and it might not work. There's also a bug that makes the ball drift slightly to the side, and sometimes that causes issues as well. But if you're host and you're on 60 FPS, this should work every time. However, a little thing to note about these book strats, if you still want to try and get the shot in multiplayer, you can open the book when you're finishing hole 14 to avoid the ball drifting to the side even just a couple pixels, line up your cursor before 15 starts, and then you can shoot as soon as possible once you get zoomed in. I still manage to get this shot in multiplayer quite often. Anyway, hope this helped. Give it a few tries. Let me know if you get it.